Hello everyone, my name is Bryce here with Bryce and Bigum yet again today. Uh, hope y'all are having a great day today. It's a rainy day here in Chicago and I thought I'd just do a little vlog. Uh, I'm down in my basement, this is my basement area, my bar, uh, the beer wall. Um, I was at Mississippi State visiting my friend Carson and one of his, well, I honestly don't even know where I met this kid. His name's Toddy, great guy, love him to death. His dorm room had like a beer wall where they're like every case they drank, they uh, they would like cut off the side of the case and then have people sign it when they came in. So I decided, eh, what the hell, I'll do it too. Um, yeah, so there's the beer wall. This is just a little tour. Got the stairs going upstairs. A little cat zone, bean bag, more beer signs. Um, we've got like an exorbitant amount of beer signs. There's a bunch under this couch here. There's the TV, all that area. The Gibby flag, can't forget that. Um, yeah, but let's head on over to the audio system. And I'll be right back. All right, so we're back with the audio system, and here's what I'm rocking. I have the Sony 200 CD disc changer. Love this thing to death. Got the Cowboy Bebop CD on deck. <laughs> this thing is literally just a jukebox. Um got maybe let's see how many cds i have in there it'll stop and tell us all right so i have 79 cds in there a uh, decent number here's my record collection moved over from nashville and here's my new record player i got the project debut carbon from this place called saturday audio exchange over on Belmont. It's the street I live near. <laughs> Love it to death. Super nice carbon fiber tone arm. Nice little counterweight and an anti-skid weight. Love it to death. Talking Head 77 is on deck. It's great. This is the receiver I have. It's the Harman Kardon HK495i. Looks old, but really solid. Uh, got two speaker systems. Can adjust the bass treble balance left or right volume knob and then you've got all these buttons so kind of amplifies the speakers a little bit got your tape decks because i do have this cassette player we'll get there uh, subsonic filters mono audio mode that way you don't have to worry about balance and then your tuning mode and then this is for fm and am i don't have an antenna right now um, I don't want one. I don't listen to FM that much. Um, yeah. So here's the cassette player. Can't remember where I got this. I think I got this at a thrift store for like $5, but it's a good find. It works great. It's got your your counters and everything. Let's see what cassettes I got in there. Um, let's see. Who's Pearl Jam. And Taking Back Sunday. So what a, what a combination. Both great bands, though. Uh, there's the window with all the books. Hail the Sun flag. And then these are my speakers. So these are Mirage speakers. They're really good. I love them to death. That's what they look like. I got them used. So this tweeter has got a little bit of a dent in it. Clearly, the other owner didn't take care of them. Whenever we have parties at my house, I move them out of the room. Let me just pop this back on there. And let's see. I'm not sure what models model these are. Damn it. Well, there's the model right there. The audiophile speaker system. But they're wonderful. And they're loud. Um, we've used them for parties. And then over there, I've got my little TV set up. I got a subwoofer and three little speakers. Definitely not audiophile grade. But yeah, that's my tour of the audio system. Not too much, not too little, but it works for me. I'm a college student balling on a budget. It was under a grand in total. So the expensive parts buying all the CDs and I will do a video on my collection of records and CDs. I'm also planning on doing a video of my like top songs and albums right now. So be looking forward to that and that'll be posted later this week.